Okra explained that her childhood was filled with abuse that no one should experience. For the first six years of her life, Winfrey was raised by her strict grandmother in poverty. Back then, they were so poor that we often wore dresses made of 42 shacks. She whipped me so badly that they had walls on my back and the world would bled. So then I got another whipping for getting blood and address. For ages 9 to 13, she was sexually abused by her cousin, uncle and a family friend. At 14, Winfrey became pregnant with sadly the baby was born prematurely and died in a hospital weeks later. So how her life changed. Eventually, Ofra moved away to live with her father in Tennessee where she attended Tennessee State University and got her start in communication. During high school, we forgot a part-time job at a local black radio station. At 19, she began going during the local evening news. At the time, she was both the youngest news anchor and the first black female news anchor for Nashville, WLAC-TV. In 1983, Ofra Winfrey Big Break came in when she started hosting Chicago, WLAS TV, a low rated half hour morning talk show in Chicago. With months, the show became the highest rated talk show in Chicago after Winfrey took over. Three years later, her show was expanded to a full hour, ruining the Ofra Winfrey show and went national, making Winfrey a millionaire. We have Restore is a perfect example of what's possible. Regardless of where we were one in how you were raised during your own into wisdom. So what's your story? Thanks for your watching.